Well, hey, good morning, Kent City Church family. As you can see, this is I'm doing my normal Thanksgiving routine. I'm playing football. You notice I'm here at the stadium. Problem is, it's empty. Nobody's here. I mean, look at that. Even if you go pay on the whole field, nobody showed up because it's quarantine time. So what I decided to do is go play football on my own. You know how it is. They say, hey, at least we're doing something. So I'm trying to pass the ball to myself. It's really difficult. I'll even look up here. There's no fans, no nothing. Sad, isn't it? But, you know, with that in mind, I'm just going to go do it on my own. I'm going to go run, you know. So here I go. I'm going to go down. To Whoa, who is that? Whoa. Joe Davis, I have not seen you in years. What is going on? You come here too? I do. I, I come here too. What are you doing here, Joe? I'm here to play football, but nobody else is here. It's just you and me. So you wanna you wanna you wanna form a game? I would love to hit somebody that's wearing an Ohio State shirt. Well, well, I guess that's okay. Well, it's just you and me. It's just you and me. So I guess it's kind of like the church, just you and me, kind of distancing, and nobody really needs it. Nobody needs football either. Wait, Joe, look behind you. Oh, <laughs> they can't stay away. We need each other. Let's play some football. Let's play some football. Let me see you go run, Joe. Go out there and run. Throw the ball to the guys. We're going to get ready for a game. And while they get ready, let me talk a little bit to you. You know, football is a tradition. Tradition with many of us. We who have grown up in homes where our dads had brought us out on an early Friday morning while the wives are out doing their shopping, we go out and we play football. We love it. But we are told we have to do this alone. How can you play football alone? It's the joy of the interaction with the guys. You know, if I just play by myself, I can think I'm really great. I'm great at football. Wow, I can throw balls. I can catch anything. But when you get out there with the real thing, you really see if you're any good. You have interaction. I would say three things about football. Number one, you can, you can, be, you can be smart about it, but are you really good at it? Number two, I would say... Do you care about the people you play with? If you do, you go out and play with them. And number three, I'll say this. You want to make some memories? You want to form some real bond and relationships? You have to have personal touch, one-on-one. -on -one. That's where it all begins. I mean, look at these guys. They're out there enjoying it. They're keeping distance. But you know what? Community needs people. This is just a simple way to say, we need church. We need each other. You can sit at home alone, but there is nothing like the smiles, the laughter, the reality of being with people. That's how God made it. That's how he made it. There's a verse in scripture that says where two or more are gathered, he's there among us. It's almost like a catalyst. When you have one person, meh, you can follow God. You can worship God. When you have two people, something happens. You had three dynamic takes place and I believe the Spirit of God's involved in that. So I'm gonna go play some football with some guys. Have a great weekend and remember we need each other. We really do.